Hey guys, Wadok Studios here, and um, today I'm going to go over something that seems to be plaguing the VR community. Um, I talked about this, I actually have a video on this uh, that explains how to fix the busted shadow issue in Unreal Engine 5.4.1 after they actually the 5.4 release because it was working in preview and I believe the release actually broke it. Um, and then it, the issue continued to like plague each subsequent release. So um, if you if you if you're not new to my channel, you realized I posted a fix to this, um, and then others have reached out because I posted a fix to this to say, hey, this is still broken. So this is a video from um, Morning Trails VRE channel, Discord channel. Um, one of the users there, um, huge shout out to. Um, VRE, it's, it's, it's a great resource if you're developing a VR game, um, but I believe his name is uh, Tahun, he's German, um, or it's T-A-H-U-N, huge shout out to him and Timothy Brake and a couple of other people that have brought this to my attention. Um, so <clears throat> the, the fix um, that went in for previous engine versions, um, it will and the one that I posted, like, I think more actually added it to VRE for 5.4, 5.3, yeah. Um, that will fix shadows in PIE. Um, you know, so, like, normally if you're working in flat, you're not going to see this issue. Um, and if you're still on 5.4.1 and you haven't downloaded the hotfix, then that'll fix it there as well. Um, but some other changes got pulled in that impacts the um, stereo instancing uh, index value so that that fix doesn't quite fix um, everything. Whenever you uh, play in VR, you preview in VR, you're going to see a distorted shadow. Here it's hard to tell because you can't see the stereo view, but essentially this is in the left eye only. So things are going to look good in the right eye but in the left eye you're gonna see this weird shadow distortion issue um, and they they're gonna appear to follow you around it's, things just aren't gonna look quite right um, I do have a fix for this um, I uh, everybody who's a member of the Waldox Studios discord channel um, and who is a uh, you know, a subscriber here, <clears throat> you know, thank you guys. Y'all make stuff like this possible. Um, I appreciate the request and the recommendations on, you know, what to post, but um, there's a, sh a, por a, f uh, a forum post. <laughs> I, I can't speak English today. There's a forum post here and I'll include the link to this um, in the video description where I've included a location to grab the updated shaders directory so if you're on 54541 this YouTube video works and that shader fix works if you're in 542 you're gonna need to grab this entire zip directory because there's multiple files that were needed to correct the issue I haven't been able to test in standalone Oculus Quest MultiView just yet, um, but I can tell you if you if you want shadows and you don't want to manually patch shaders in your um, UE54 engine directory, you can just disable instant stereo or MultiView, and that should work around the issue. I say should lightly because I've gotten reports that shadows aren't working for non-Oculus branch builds. Uh, for standalone anyway, but um, I can confirm this does fix the issue when you're running in um, OpenXR. Like, so if you're on Steam VR or PC, you know, Vive, um, you know, using the Oculus app through OpenXR uh, in the editor, um, this will correct the issue. Anyway, happy developing. Uh, catch you guys later. Oh, like, subscribe, join the Discord, give me ideas on the next video. Toodles.